let's take a look at what the garden looks like here in September first of September well here's the popcorn I like to make uh, these videos so I can go back next year and look at them see what everything is like this time of year popcorn And it's like the squash is about all gone. Gee, what's this in our garden here? What is this thing? Wow. I think it's corn. It's not Bigfoot. And these feet's not that big. Now it's not Halloween in September. It must be, well, we'll have to do a little bit more investigating here to see what it is. Hey, are you, uh, what's your name? Corn Man. And you was brought, hurried to come in and keep the birds away, so, uh, so it wouldn't eat the corn, they wouldn't eat the corn up? Well, let's take a look here and see if we can find out what's, uh, what's going on here. Yes, it looks like, it looks like the birds has been trying to do some damage here to the corn. Let's see, look at right, right here they this is popcorn. They've been working on the popcorn. Well, I hope corn man can give us some relief here. I mean what would we do without corn man? And there's some peppers that fell over. As you can see, I put more uh, grass clippings right on top of our wood chips. And uh, they will should just rot up there and turn into some good black dirt by next year. Here's some beans she's saving for seeds. A lot more peppers left here. She canned a lot of peppers, but there's still a lot of them. Yes, there's lots of peppers left here in September. And here's uh, some more beans, pole beans to save for seed. You never know, times may get pretty hard and you have to have all these seed. Now what's this here? It looks like an apple growing on the tomatoes. Oh, I hardly think so. Hope Corn Man didn't do that. Maybe trying to deter the birds to come over here. It looks like the Tomatoes are getting pretty scarce here now. She canned a lot of them. Let's go on down through here. Sounds like 
like the neighbors down there baling some hay. Let's, uh, let's dig down here and see if I can get this. Get this spade out of here. Dig down here and see what we have here. See, there's there's some of the wood chips, but they won't be. See the dirt down in there. The wood chips won't be. Uh, it'll take them a while to break up and turn into some good black soil. Here's the popcorn we've been watching all summer. Or not popcorn, the sweet corn. That was just planted directly in wood chips. No, nothing else. Just wood chips. The first year of wood chips. First time we put them on the garden was this year. And uh, <clears throat> we've already ate most of that. But it, look how tall it is there. Just growing out of wood chips. Of course, down here's a row of carrots. There's some acorn squash. Butternut squash. Some more over here. The maker and squash is kind of kind of pretty there. There's a pretty color to it, but I think they're gonna rot. Made some racks here to put the beans on that I haven't got up here yet to dry out, save for seed. There's a couple of rows of potatoes here. Some more tomatoes. We had some huge tomatoes this, this year. Here's the beans that will be pulled up and put up on that rack to dry for seed. And this sweet corn here is ready to be chopped down and going to work this gar er, ground up right through here with a teller. Some more potatoes down here. Be digging them. Usually don't dig them to about the second week of October. So that's all for now. Please subscribe to our channel and keep up to date with everything here.